28 minutes to one with David till three o'clock this afternoon. And with me in the studio is, uh, is Philip, Philip Stader and his dog Bertie. And his dog, well, your dog is, is famous worldwide, isn't he, really? Let's he be honest. He really is. Bertie Lakeland is the Twitter account. And he's got, what, 15, going on for 15,000 followers. And um, the reason he's in today is because um, quite an incredible thing happened about three months ago. And he got lost. And this was, quite, this was my first moment where I was aware of his existence when all of a sudden the tweets and the texts and the emails came in from people everywhere. We were just sitting in the studio and all of a sudden, bang, 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 can you help find this dog? Tell me about that. Well, my wife took him out for a walk on, um, on the morning and I was actually in Lincolnshire, miles and miles away. And I got a frantic phone call saying, Bertie's gone off. He's, um, we've walked through, the, walked through the sheep field at um, on Cleve Common. We come out the other side, no more sheep. I let him off a lead, but he's seen a sheep and he's gone off. I right. can't find him anywhere. And she was getting in quite a state. And you mentioned that the breed, the Lakeland breed, is quite and willful. They, they are very they willful. So yeah. he saw a sheep and he was going to go and find that sheep. Yeah. Um, luckily, he didn't, as it happens, but the risk was there. Unfortunately, the sheep was outside the um, fenced area. It had got out, so nobody expected it to be there. It's just one of those things. Mm. But he went off after a sheep. I was in Lincolnshire. I got a, f a frantic wife on the phone. I thought, what? do we do? How can we get anybody to help? Um, I thought, ah, Bertie can send a tweet out. So Bertie sent a tweet out. I'm, I'm lost on Cleve Hill. Yeah. Uh, if anybody can help me, please ring my mum on such and such a number. And you posted it all and online. Posted it, yeah. And within moments, her phone was going barmy with, with people trying, wanting to come and help. Um, we had friends from Twitter in town who went up to help. There was people who we'd never met and hadn't really com had conversations with on Twitter who went up and helped. Yeah. Um, Bertie's, Bertie's best friend on Twitter, Archie Lakeland, who's another <laughs> slightly naughty Lakeland, but with great character, his um, dad drove all the way from Lymington to come up and help. Absolutely incredible. So these people, there were people coming from all over the country? All over, yes. To come and look for him? Yeah. Because they'd seen it on Twitter? Yes, exactly. Isn't it amazing? Isn't that incredible? It restores your faith in human beings. So how many people did you reckon you had up there? We think there was 30, 35 people helping, <laughs> yeah, dotted, I, dotted around the common. I know that Gloucestershire Live ran it as a story. Yep. You know, famous dog has gone missing, Yeah, I, effectively. I started to drive back from Lincolnshire. I got back to somewhere near Warwick, and lo and behold, he was found. A very nice man called Martin, one of his friends from Twitter, who's who's the owner of Norm and Kimmy, who are Welsh Terriers. Yeah. He f he walked back to the car to charge his phone apparently, and there was late Bertie sitting next to sitting next to the car, who then <laughs> dutifully wanted to play. <laughs> wow! But what a relief as well. What a relief! Oh, total relief. Yeah. You know, because yeah. it, it, famous dog or not, it's scary. Oh. It's a scary thing. It is a scary thing. But the problem is, we'd we, he disappeared a couple of times after deer and varying things, so we'd had it happen. Yeah. Um, but we hadn't gone as far as getting a tracker or anything else. Now he wears a tracker when he goes out all the time, so he does go at least. We can pick up a phone and see exactly where he is so we can go to the point, point where he's got to. But um, a, a very surreal day, let's put it that way. Well, I'll tell you what, not half, sitting here, watching the numbers of people actually pretty much insisting that we stop what we're doing. Can you just stop what you're doing? There's a dog missing here in Cheltenham. This is important. <laughs> and these are people from all over the world tweeting us at Radio Gloucestershire saying, can you, can you mention this Radio Gloucestershire? Can you stop everything? Your following is incredible. It, it is. It's amazing. And... Um, I'm not really entirely sure why it's gone as it is, but I think he just brings a lot of joy. Mm. Um, we don't tweet anything special. He, he, as I say, he sings a few songs and he reads a few books and he goes out and about and gets... He's, he has a habit of sitting on things quite high up, which he enjoys doing. He'll go and sit on a tractor at work and things like that. And he, he's quite a nice chap to look at and he's got quite a funny little face. Mm. Um, but I think he makes people smile and everybody needs to smile, don't they, at the end of the day? They do. Tell me about the connections you've made here and the friendships you've made through this. Oh, we made some wonderful friendships. Um, there's, a, there's a whole group of dogs who all converse with each other and the owners converse with each other. We've, we've met up and had barbecues. Um, Chuck Bennett, who is a show dog who goes to Crufts, his uh, mother, is she does grooming. She's also got a proper job, but she does grooming. She's groomed Bertie. Um, we went to a barbecue down in the in the... In the, on the south coast a few weeks ago, which was fabulous, and met up with lots of people and some of the dogs. So social it's media dogs all social met up. Social media dogs all met up. <laughs> and there was a few woofs and a few growls. And, um, it's, I, this is nothing like you ever imagined when you, you first started. No, this. not at all, in any way, shape or form. But everybody is fantastic. Um, 
it's totally non-political. Some people will tweet and say we like it because there's, there's no political connotations or anything like that. It's just very light-hearted, very good fun yeah. and very easygoing. And let's not forget, you started this just as a way of finding out more about the breed, really. Exactly. And connecting yeah. with people yeah. who had this breed, which is becoming, sadly, more obscure. More obscure, yes. Less, less people are breeding Lakelands. There's yeah. less people having Lakelands. Wow. Which is such a shame. Yeah, well, it is. Now, he's just sat here perfectly quietly with a microphone by him, just in case he makes a noise as we go through here. Um, but the reach is amazing. What now? Where do you go with it from here? Uh, good question. Who knows? We, we'll just continue doing it the way we are. Is there a business in this? Uh, I would doubt it. But, is there not? Um, you know, it may well be. Bertie Who knows? Merchandise and all that business. You know, people yeah. make a lot of money out of this sort of stuff. Uh, maybe, but it's, he's, he's just an everyday pet dog who yeah. likes to have a bit of fun. With thousands of followers around yeah. the world. Amazing. It, it makes him smile. That's it, what it's it about. It does, it does. And particularly the videos where you where he sings as well. It's yeah. very, very interesting as well. And so he's got a tracker on, so we're not going to get a lost situation again. Well, he hasn't got it on today in here, because right. I think he's quite safe in here. No, I, I think, think he's, he's going to go anyway, safe looking, looking at the surroundings. Absolutely but, but yeah, when we take him out now, he, he goes out of a tracker on most of the time. Yeah, brilliant. Just, just, just for safety's sake. We don't want to go through another day like that. You don't, you don't. So, uh, the dog with international fans all over the world, and he's um, quite nonchalant here, sitting here. Chilled out, relaxed. He really doesn't mind. Much better than I thought he would be. <laughs> but it's lovely to see you. Thank you for Thank having me. Thank you for coming in. Uh, I hope I look for. I'm a follower now, so I hope he continue, continues to go from strength to strength and uh, on your Twitter account. We'll, we'll try and keep you all amused and make you smile. And who knows, Bertie for Strictly Come Dancing. That's what I say. Yep. Good to see you. Thank you.